What's up, ladies and gentlemen? You're watching the YouTube station identification. I want to do better for Massachusetts resident YouTubers. I'm here live in the basement. No, this is not MTV's remote control. And my name is not Ken Obert. God rest his soul. My name is Eric Leeming. You're watching WEML TV Channel 77, episode 162, uh, April 20th, 2021, 3.34 uh, p.m. I'm almost like, a.m. I'm like, sleeping right now. Um, <laughs> Um, like I said, I got, just got back to um, I got back to work yesterday, and we're gonna I'm gonna work all this week, and then next week I have only five days off. I am not having uh, May first off. In fact, I'll be working May first after my vacation because May first is my hire date, and that's where the vacation hours end. So I'm taking my last five days off, and then we will next week, and then we're gonna get start at the beginning of May working and back to the grind once again, and I will be sparingly um coming on here on youtube and um may have to make some a little bit more changes but i think i'm getting lucky and if somehow things work out in the long run over the summer and all that and if uh if somebody if they if they decided well we're getting you back monday for friday then it'll be back to uh, that so my routine's gonna be changed up a little bit it'll be for a while it'll be for a while work six days a week and uh I know it's not going to be very easy because it has uh, lots of wear and tear. You know, you you come home from you come home from work and then shopping and all that, and your feet look like they have weights on them. You know what I mean? It's like ah, uh, you get up and you're trying to walk. You're like crap. After working like four, almost three, um, three and a half, four hours of a freaking day, you know, and you're like oh, you know, like you're getting tired out and stuff. And it's like oh my gosh. So hopefully, <clears throat> hopefully I'll be okay. Um. I can tell you what gets my goat. You know, you know, I go on TikTok, right? I've decided to lip sync uh, "Careless Whisper" by Wham, aka George Michael and Andrew Ridgely, for those you don't know. And I got positive compliments uh, comments on, on the video. They say sing it, that some of the ladies loved it, and that's cool. When I'm cool with that, but then there's the negative comments about my looks. Now, I just, it's all. It's, it's, I'm sick and tired of it. It's all played out every single time. It's always about the teeth, the hair, my looks, my personality, the room, and everything else. Dude, dudes, I know I'm not good looking. I am not the sexiest man in the universe. I get that. I understand that. But do you have to keep talking about it? I don't need I don't need the negativity. That's why I, that's why I block people. I'm sick and tired of negativity. We got too much negativity in the world going on. You watch the news. Too much negativity, bro. Too much negativity. That's why I block people. I'm not blocking people because I'm a coward. I'm blocking people because if they have a negative attitude towards me, I don't want their negativity. Back it up with the negativity. Back it off with the negativity, man. Listen, I know what's going on in the world. No problem. I got no. I know what's going on in the world. I know what I look like, dude. Like. Dudes, I mean, you serious about this? Let me do. Let me go on TikTok and have some fun. That's all that matters to me. I'm not worried about good looks. As far from my end, I mean, look at me. You think I'm gonna get a girlfriend in my life? I haven't got a girlfriend. I don't have a wife. I don't. You know, I have. A, I don't live in freaking Hollywood. The problem is that people out there think they're the executive producers of your life, your looks, and your personality. I cannot allow that. I cannot allow that. I don't care if I'm on the internet and I'm, if everybody is see. I don't care. I'm sick of the negativity. I'm sick of people making uh, making you know, stupid comments about the way I look, the way I you know do things. You know, it's like it's ridiculous, man. The reason why I'm smiling is because I'm not going to get totally angry about it because it's all because it's been played out, dudes. Give it a rest. You're miserable with your lives, man. That's the problem. You're miserable in your life. I'm trying to live my life the best way I know how. And here you guys are crying and whining about my looks. And I go, you know, I look at my TikTok. I'm like, really? Really? You know, do you have to go with the jokes, with the insults of my, my looks? Like, what is your problem? What is your major malfunction? I'm just here to have fun. I like do that's why I do my videos on YouTube just to have fun, make people smile, and interact with interact with good people that bring positive energy, a positive influence. And here and here you are. And your teeth are right. Oh God, please! You don't think I know that? Do I care? 
to know that, no, I'm doing this for having fun, bro. This is all about fun. You guys want, you guys want to troll me about my looks on TikTok? My goodness, I'm like, good lord, what is people's problem? What is their problem here? They don't think I know that already? <laughs> I'm like, oh my goodness. I'm trying to look presentable at least, you know? You know, listen, I don't have the money to make myself Hollywood material, okay? I live in the roughest, toughest city in the state, in the country, all right? And you know what? It's hard nowadays. You know, it's hard nowadays. It's like, come on. With everything going on in the world right now, and with everything happening, it's like, oh my gosh, you know, I don't work a high-paying job. I work a job for minimum, I work a minimum wage job, part-time. For six days, for six, six days, and I work in the mornings. Do I like it? No, but it, it's a job. I need a job. It's more of a need than a want. All right? May not be the ideal job for me. But what my point is, my point is, these negative attitudes have got to stop. It's got to stop. I don't care what I look like. It's all about in here. All about in here, the heart. I don't look on the outside of a person. God says he doesn't look on the outward of a person. He works at the inside. It seems like you idiots out there don't even get it. I mean, you know, <laughs> I, I, some of the stupid comments on TikTok. One, you know, uh, some of the stupid com comments made on TikTok, and this is, you know, people have gone TikTok crazy on this. And, well, and I was doing the Carol's Whisper Bridge there. You know, tonight, music seems so loud. That part. <laughs> and one person's like, that's not you singing. No freaking dog! It's not me singing! It's lip syncing! It's a thing! If you lip sync Paramount on Spike TV on Paramount Network, now it's called. No freaking dog! <laughs> That's not you singing. No, Dolly! No, Dolly! No, Dolly! No, Dolly! Yeah. <laughs> That's not you singing. No, doy. Oh, good lord. Oh, my God. I mean, so I some, I said, you know, today's 420. How much weed did you smoke before you came up with that statement? Oh, my God. It's the funniest thing in the world, man. It's like, come on. Seriously, bro? You're going to go with that? And some people, oof, I can't. And like, dudes, let me have my fun. I just want to have fun. That's all. I want to have fun doing my thing here. Not only on TikTok, but on here on YouTube. You know, YouTube, nobody has given me any problems since the beginning of the year, which is great, you know. Well, actually, since December, I haven't got any issues, you know. I had bots um, comment on my page, though, with different things, not... Not the same tired out comments I've been seeing over the summers between 2016 2018 and over the summer last year but you know bots of you know dating and you know, all dating sex bots and all that it's like I have to block and like there's like this message to them that I blocked hey change your password do something you know and, and prevent hacking on my YouTube that's probably another thing too why I might have blocked those Individuals prevented hacking on my YouTube, but nonetheless, but nonetheless, okay, I, I, I'm just, I'm just, it just amazes me. It's like, dudes, I know I'm not good looking, duh. No, doy, I'm not good looking. No, doy, that's not me singing. I'm just being me. I like being. Lip syncing is a thing. Hurt, you heard a lip sync battle, dudes, dudes. Chill. Now, for those who have 
giving me positive com uh, comments on, on my TikToks. Thank you. I appreciate that. It means a lot to me. You know, like I said, if my video had not had 300, uh, 3,000 views, which I was amazed of how many views I got from that Callous Whisper video I did on TikTok. 3,000 sticking views. I'm like, what the crap I've never had that many views in my life. You know what I mean? I have over, over a, a thousand views of some of my videos it did back in the time. But, you know, I did with the Bullseye tribute video and all that and the music. and But, in the, some, I, you know, but over 3,000 views on a video on TikTok. That's insane. It's almost 3,500, I think. It's crazy, you know? Oh, my goodness. But just future reference, backing off on the negative comments because I already know. All, all I can tell you, I've got two words. No doy. It's not you singing. No doy. You don't, you know, you, you cheat. No doy. Now my teeth's not good looking. I'm not good looking, period. Now, if any woman thinks I'm good looking, I'd be shot. If I had a dime, for every time a woman says I'm cute and handsome and all that, a real woman telling me that, I wouldn't have much to go on. I would have bought myself a freaking uh, uh, a value meal at McDonald's. Because I don't have much when it comes to that. You know, it's like, I don't have any, you know. It just, it just amazes me that like, people just want like, anything negative. Like, I'm trying to have fun here, and they want to bring your mood down, make you angry, and make you feel in a negative person, and make you miserable. Listen, seriously, though, words do hurt. And they hurt really bad to people out there. You see people commit suicide over that. And that's why I'm trying to prevent that mindset of mine to go through. You know what I mean? I don't want it. I don't want negativity. I don't want people making making stupid comments like I've been seeing on TikTok. Mostly it's on TikTok now. Not here on YouTube. YouTube YouTube's been quiet since December, man. As far as, you know, I'm not saying, you know, I'm just saying, you know. Which is really amazing, which, hey, I like it. <laughs> I like it. You know, the original, um, usually Vaughn Baskin will give me some crazy comments. And uh, which, which uh, I, I got to do uh, raw, got to get to the raw interview. I'm really sorry about this, folks, man. I, I was, oh, uh, craziness. Craziness. Is, I'm doing a lot of craziness. But happy 25th anniversary to Power Rangers Zio on this date back in 1996. I remember watching that first episode. It has made its debut. On Fox Kids, and uh, over the years we saw, we saw a lot of cool, we saw a lot of real stuff, and you know uh, that was the last time we saw David Yost as Billy on the first um, first time since season two of Power Rangers. We saw Austin St. John who became chosen as the new Gold Ranger, and lots of you know you know and just you know like for, so it, it was a it was a really cool thing, and then. They ended defeating Mondo and the Machine Empire after, but then Reader and Zed kind of beat him to the punch by um, pulling a prank on the Machine Empire by getting little explosive gifts, um, pouring them apart. So, but in the end, the Space Rangers did ultimately destroy them by using Zodan's energy wave and all that good stuff. But 25th anniversary of Power Rangers ZO. Congratulations to to um, Power Rangers ZO. And I'm sure the, the, the legacy and Super Sentai, oh, uh, Toriki Sentai Oranger, continuing on in the 45th season of Super Sentai, known as Kikai Sentai Zenkaiger, where this coming Sunday you see the debut of Zenkai Gold, or Two Kaiser, as he's called. And so pictures of Two Kaiser, pretty, pretty unique, let me tell you. All right, then. That is it. That's all the time I have here. I just, well... Just want to get a little bit of out, you know, this out of my system. And uh, on the next episode, we're going to do the Raw um, Raw Event Center, Thunderdome Event Center. Lots to talk about there. So uh, uh, I will see you guys on the next episode of WEML TV, Channel 77. You guys have a great and wonderful day. Um, and uh, catch you in the next episode. Bless out.